Good morning, boys and girls. Old Ron Hines coming back at you. How y'all doing today? Hey, look here. First thing, I'm going to get this out of the way. Y'all can call, call me old-fashioned if you want, but it, with today's uh, weirdness that's going on and the devil just showing his face all over the place, I sure am glad my mother was just a plain Jane woman. Yep, I'm old-fashioned. All right, so now I'm going to get you some news. All right, so as y'all know, uh, we have a presidential race going up. Well, Kamala Harris and the Balor guy, uh, Tim Waltz, I think is his name, the VP, they showed up in Savannah, Georgia. And uh, number one, they didn't have any rock stars or no famous people singing. So they actually had to bus in the supporters, all right? And that's in Savannah. And then on top of that, Kamala Harris actually behaved in such a fashion that she made good old Joey Biden look good. In fact, one of the reporters uh, that had written some stuff, I saw this on the Gateway Pundit, was actually wondering if she was inebriated or not. So that's pretty bad. So this is the person that is running for president of these here United States. May, now, I'm not getting a good feeling about that. So anyway, uh, I brought up Aurora, Colorado yesterday. Some people looked that up, so you can see, and I'm not lying to you, that the, the truth is out there if you go search for it. So there's some issues here in this country. Hey, uh, and Joe Biden, Kamala Harris, now that you want his job, you want to take over, you're responsible, you where our borders are. So every time a Venezuelan kills somebody, that blood's on your hands. I want you to know that. And I'm not playing with that one. That That's... uh. That's not cool. Not cool at all. So anyway, and yesterday, late, late last night, up there in Dallas, there was a, a cop was found uh, unresponsive in the car. So other cops went there. It was a shootout. I think three of them got shot. One of them's at least dead. But anyway, one of the thoughts was when I was hearing the news, I heard that on the t television. I actually had it on. But when I heard that on the news, one of my thoughts was, are these people from Venezuela trying to do something in Dallas? Uh, all I'm going to say is if anybody tries to hijack my car, my truck, do anything heinous to me, I'm going to just pretend they're a Venezuelan because I know what I would do to protect myself. Maybe that'll be your defense too in case you get into a little ruckus. Yeah, I use the word ruckus. Anyway, look. Old flag used to be upside down, but I had to change it. I'll be checking my numbers, see what they've done that, uh, how I'm being censored, because we know Mark Zuckerberg censored others on Facebook. And number next is, I want you to go out and help somebody today. Be somebody's uh, savior out there, not, not, not comparing you to Jesus in any form or fashion, but be there, help them. Uh, the world needs more love and compassion as the things I'm describing here, as you know. So anyway, with that being said, be sure to like, subscribe, hit the bell. We'll be coming at you soon. Have a great day. And Labor Day is coming up, so if you're traveling or whatever when this weekend gets here, be sure to travel safe and do all the things that uh, you and your family need to do to have a good time. All right, we'll be coming at you soon. God bless you all.